haunted Corvin Castle, a 600 year old remarkable structure that looks as though it came right from a fairy tale, with a stunning exterior crested in marvelous spires and a drawbridge of infinite beauty. Yet this charming fortress is only a facade for its horrifically dark past. I actually don't know if anyone's ever done a paranormal investigation here. Shackled by the ankles and hung from their neck and their wrists. It used to have a prison and a torture room because mm. these were essential in those times. Oh my god. I thought she was giving birth. We do not mean any harm at all to you, but we think that you might be able to see and hear us. God damn it. Oh, 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 oh Did you see that? Did you that see that? That had to be you. No, that had to be Jonah. No way! That had to be Jonah. It was not! No, that had to be your shadow. It wasn't. It was a purse. It was a head and it was shoulders and it was going to the left. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be down here. Holy shit. Who the f dude? Who the f is that? It was a full f***ing body. Head, shoulders, body. It's not in these different rooms. It's actually next to me. You can follow us. Follow us to the torture chamber. Please stand next to the door and make one of our devices go off. If you're here to do me harm, can you please light it up right now? You're right, I'm right. You're here with me. I really screwed up. Welcome to the Overnight Channel, dedicated to finding proof of the paranormal. Tonight's investigation takes place at Corvin Castle, Dungeons and Demons. What's up everyone and welcome back to the Overnight Channel that is dedicated to all things paranormal, mysterious, unknown, unsolved, just an incredible Untamed. theatrical. I have no idea what's happening, but that's what this whole channel is about. Uh -huh. We're at Corvin Castle in Romania. And we have the entire place to ourselves for the entire night to do whatever we want, which was probably a really bad decision on the staff here that let us do this. Definitely. Oh my God. Definitely. <laughs> yeah. Was it? Yeah. They don't know what they're getting themselves was into. It? If we respect the castle, yeah. We should be fine. Yeah. So when we walk in there, we should probably act as if mm. we were in the what is it? 12, that time. Twelve hundreds. Yeah. 1300s? It was built. It 1300s. was built in the fourteenth century, so thirteen hundreds and beyond. It was built. Okay. So who wants to be the queen? Well, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Depends on who's the king. I'll be the king. Then I'll be the queen. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What about you? I feel like you just used this whole castle just to announce that you guys are in a relationship now. No. Like no. you didn't even need us. All right, you guys, uh, you guys torture me at frame. least in there. Yeah. <laughs> that Corey and Corbin here, and we're at the Corvin Castle, <laughs> and uh, we actually bought this castle. They named it after me because we wanted to announce that we are having a baby. <laughs> <laughs> Right, should we go inside? Let's go inside. Right, let's go give inside. birth real quick. Yeah, let's go. Should that be the first Come thing we do? Should yeah. I give birth as soon as we walk yeah, inside? Yeah, for sure. Okay, just to be respectful. Is that the moon? Are we getting a full like blood moon tonight? Yes. That's it, right? Uh, that yeah. is the moon I coming over. Time of the month for the moon. The 15th century Gothic Renaissance Corvin Castle is now the most visited tourist attraction in all of Romania due to its immaculate beauty and equally vast and complicated history. Originally designed as a stronghold, the uses have been diverse as kingdoms have come and gone. Over the centuries, a never-ending battle of destruction and repair has been waging between Mother Nature and mankind, leading to the impeccable structure that now stands today. Yet through all of its remarkable owners and history, it is most notably known as a prison and torture chamber, and is rumored to have held the notorious Vlad the Impaler as prisoner for seven years. 600 years of stories passed from generation to generation have led many to believe Vlad slowly turned mad as he was 
kept isolated in a pitch black cell in the dungeon beneath the Hall of Nights, where the only sounds he would hear were the screams of fellow prisoners being tortured and executed. Even if the rumor of the real life Dracula being locked away in the dungeon is simply that, a rumor, the hundreds of years where the prisoners, torture devices, and executions are real, and these same devices stained with the blood and final living moments of so many lives still reside within the walls of Corbin Castle. The well that consumed the final living moments of the three Turkish prisoners still stands. The Capistrano Tower, where a monk was sealed away until his final breath left him, still stands. And the dungeon, so secluded and concealed that even the stories were never able to escape it, still exist. This is by far the oldest of all haunted locations we have ever been. We're embracing for encounters with the spirits that are as resilient as the castle is itself. Welcome to the Overnight Channel, dedicated to finding proofs of the paranormal. Please make sure to subscribe as we have brand new investigations and locations every week. If you hear or see anything that we did not during our investigation, please leave a comment and we will be reading them all. I just want to give a big thank you to our sponsor, Bright Cellars, who made this night possible in the first place. To have this entire castle, this historic place, entirely to ourselves for a night was truly incredible and it wouldn't be possible without them. And if you don't know, Bright Cellars is a subscription service on a monthly basis that provides you with custom curated wines. If you just go online and you use their quiz and you just pick all the things that you like and then boom, perfectly curated six bottles of wine right here, ready to go. And as you all know, I love trying new things. So having Bright Cellars just surprise me with new flavors that it knows pretty well that I'm gonna like is a pretty cool experience that I get to share with my friends, my roommates, and my family. And the best part is that Bright Cellars uses wines from all around the world, finding those hidden gems and those private label vineyards that you may not have found on your own. And all you have to do to get your first box is just head online and answer a very, very simple seven question question quiz that allows them to curate the box just for you, which means no box is ever the same. And of course, every box is delivered right to you. So you don't have to waste any time going to the liquor store, looking around, or possibly even waste any money buying something that may not suit your taste. Right now, Bright Sellers is giving 50% off to all of our subscribers, which is you guys, on their first six bottle box, which is what I have right here. So for $45, you're getting everything you see here. And all you have to do is click the link in the description and answer that incredibly easy and kind of fun quiz. Thank you again to Bright Sellers for making tonight possible at Corbin Castle. And of course, thank you all so much for supporting the Overnight Channel. I promise you this video tonight will not disappoint and everything else we have in store for Romania and the UK series that's coming up after. Enjoy. Someone's getting possessed tonight. <laughs> well, don't say that. I don't know who yeah. yeah. That's just why I like when a you're here. Yeah. <laughs> it's a full moon too. Corey's like, I'm gonna give birth, I'm a queen. Josh is like, we're getting possessed. <laughs> <laughs> we're on a different aspect. Wait, you don't right think now. my baby's gonna get possessed, do you? Devil baby? It's usually two what for one deal, you know? Oh, wow. What Look, is that? here's the moon. Oh. Griffin Oh. No, just Griffin. Ah. Wow. Oh my god, this is actually beautiful. Oh, it's a double cross. They would have a bear down here, and then they would throw people in. And if you can defeat the bear, you can live? No one defeats the bear. <laughs> Nobody? Nobody can no defeat, one the defeats bear. the bear. What about that Russian have MMA you? fighter? What's his name? Oh, Khabib? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like he can wrestle the bear. Oh, he has, yeah, when he was a kid. Being thrown into a so bear? Is no. it what, like people that were pretty much like sentenced to death, they would get eaten by a bear? Or if they didn't like you? It didn't matter, they could do whatever they want. Whatever the king I, wanted to do, he could throw people down there. That's terrible. Yeah. What the, what, yeah. Yeah, it is. Oh, I didn't know kings were like that. Yes, thought, of course. I thought it times, man. Do you know the story of Vlad the Impaler? No. Oh. Tell me. What do you think he did? <laughs> he came to Romania and didn't even know the story. We're in Romania? <laughs> <laughs> Woo! This is where I lived. Where you sleep? Inside the. Inside the. <laughs> inside the. <laughs> <laughs> so whatever the f that is. Yeah. <laughs> 
inside the, uh, the shoe pump. Maker. Shoe pump. The, the bicycle. Yeah. yeah. You have really big, bi big bicycles. Yeah. 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 It's a bicycle. It's a bicycle. You guys want to see where uh, I had my child? This is your family. Yeah. Oh. This, this that's is my father. That's dad. Yeah. <laughs> Explains a lot. <laughs> what I'm actually going to show you guys here, we can't uh, show on camera. Oh, really? So, Evan, if you can cut, and then guys, we'll be back in 20 minutes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, you guys like the experimental room? That was wild. That was honestly insane. How you feeling? I'm tired. You good? No. I can you... still taste Brandon. You what? What? What'd you say? What? I'm sorry. You can still taste too? Huh? Yeah, this is the lily for cannons and for arrows. They did what they said at the tower, yeah. Do you want to explain where we are? Yeah, of course. Okay. Sure. In the 1300s, cool. some also call that the 14th century, and it's a little bit unknown what this corridor was used for. Would you like to know? This corridor, a lot of people used to think this was for an escape to another realm. Huh? In those days, it was pronounced escape. French. Yeah. Words, French. words or change from year to year. What year did that go on from? From... <laughs> <laughs> what the f*** is happening right now? The year was 1918! I have a feeling we're going to find out about some more ways to die. That it looks is awful. Yeah, and it looks like they hung up numerous people in here. Look at all the extra chains. Yep. Oh, from like the past? No, I mean like they probably could have hung up like five more people like that hole in oh, one no cage. Why. Like look at all of the different... Yeah, look, there's more shackles here and yeah. chains yeah. here. Could you oh, imagine that like you're in there and you're just like watching each other die? Like, I'm skipping that Airbnb. That's terrible. So this is the prison and they were placed here and sentenced to death. Oh. Oh. Oh wait, yeah, look up. It looks like the whole area caught on fire at some point. Yeah. Jeez. Even the light fixture burned. Alright, our guide, I believe, and our historian is up here somewhere. Yeah. I'm excited now we to can, learn. We can get a proper tour. Ooh. Nice. Of this place. Ah, there she is. Thank Ooh. you. Nice to meet you. Thank you, you. Yes, welcome. We're in one of the most preserved castles, uh, medieval castles in Europe, actually. It was, um, it, it, it isn't me who says that, it was actually Huffington Post mm. who <laughs> says that. So, okay. which is quite good, yes. It's a castle that was built in the 15th century. And, of course, it used to have a prison and a torture room because mm. these were essential in those times. And I know you're eager to see that. Yeah. yeah? Yes. Yeah. So the legend says that one day... Uh, Does anyone, should we do a reenactment while she tells the story? Fuck, why did I pitch that idea? Again, I need a king mm -hmm. and a lady. Okay, let's, let's do a reenactment of the story while she... Let's go. One, king, one day the brave king was on a mission in Transylvania with his, with his uh, guards now riding through Transylvania. And one day he reached a place probably the bank of a river, and he saw a beautiful lady. He instantly fell in love with her. He followed her. Well, they had a walk together, they had a, a dream together. And some things happened later that night. We don't know exactly what, but what we know is that a little bit later, this girl fell, fell pregnant. The problem is that even though the two of them was, were in love and even though she had a baby or she was going to have a baby, there was nothing there could be between them because she was already married. So, unfortunately, they had to split apart, but he was quite a good man. Quite a good gentleman, actually, and liked the king, but he wanted to respect his promise to her. So he said to her, I'm gonna help you get married to a nobleman in Transylvania. He will take care of you and the baby for the rest of your life. Here, this is a ring I have for you. I'll give you this ring as a sort of a promise between us. And when the baby, if he's a boy, turns 14, you bring him to me and I will officially recognize him as my son. Okay, I will give you a son. 
Hang my dog and the girl <laughs> deliver the baby boy. <laughs> the boy grew bigger and bigger. He began quite an adolescence. He turned 14 and he really wanted to meet his real dad. So his mother, as she promised, she took him some cards, took the ring, and started their journey to meet the real dad, the Hungarian king. But as they were wandering through Transylvania, you know, admiring the landscape, they one day felt tired. So they decided to have a stop in a forest next to a river. The next day, the sun was shining and the little boy who was anxious to meet his father, was playing with a ring, a golden, beautiful ring. And as he was playing with the ring, it was shining, very shining, and the rays of the sun make it even shiny. So, one raven saw it from a branch of a tree, and while the boy was playing with the ring, came to pick it up. To steal the ring, the boy cried, and one of the guards saw that raven and shoot it. With an arrow. He killed the raven and saved the ring. The ring was saved. The boy and his, his mother continued their journey. They met a king, and the king recognized this boy as his son. So the boy actually became quite a noble black guy. So he decided for that to choose the raven as a symbol of his future coats of arms the raven with a ring in his beak. The name of the raven in Latin is called it. This became the name of the family. The future noble family of Transylvania. And see and take a bow. Wow. Take a bow. Wow. Take a bow. Wow. Take a bow. Wow. Take a bow. 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 Take a one more time. Do it one more time. One more time, it's slower. Okay. And three more times, really fast. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Let's move on. Let's go. Was that a good reenactment? Let's see. Yes. <laughs> Capistrano was a priest and a monk, let's say the trustworthy person of the king. Whenever the prince was gone, he was the one who was in charge. And in case his noblemen used to meet downstairs, there in the throne room, and chat, and even gossip. And he would listen what they were speaking downstairs. Yeah, he was a sort of a spy. They would tell the prince, you know, this one and this one, and mm, that one are not fine. I don't trust them. They're not okay. And then guess what the priest might do? Kill that shit. Burn! Burn! Hmm? Yeah. Imagine yourself digging it 15 years. 50? 15. 15. Oh, 15 years. 28 meters deep wow. in the stone. Wow, this is 100 feet deep. So after taking some Ottoman prisoners, he promised to three of them that if they dug deep enough to reach water, they would be released. Mm. So the poor guys, this was actually the only chance for life. Yeah. So they accepted it happily. She said, I don't remember any kind of promises. Uh, Honestly, I don't. I didn't make any promises. You definitely are going to die. <laughs> so uh, these poor guys had no other wish than to write. It's written, you have water, but you have no soul, no heart. Wow. wow. So that, that was their last wish. That was the yep. last thing they got yep. to do after yeah, 15 yeah. years of digging. Yeah. And how they punish people? And there is a bother, bear pit in which lots of the prisoners were thrown. Were they thrown into the bear pit? Or were mm. they like like lowered? No, no, there is a stairway. No, stairway. Easily taken, invited actually. How many people do you think were thrown into the bear pit? Probably lots. Like hundreds? It was like an entertainment. The bear I probably got lots. fat. I there were some lots, sick people, but dude. Quite a few. This was in the Middle Ages, the, the, the prison, quite short, like a cage. Mm -hmm. 
most probably heads two or three levels. The lowest were those who were sentenced to death. Oh, so they would lower these cages and yeah. bring people lower and lower? Mm -hmm. Wait. Mm -hmm. So this is the second level or is this? Most probably no, the, the upper one. I don't know exactly, this is a replica, but definitely they were like one, two, three or something oh. like this. And, and, or in the cage had various levels. And the other ones, the ones that were underneath, were the ones who were sentenced to death in most cases. Oh my. Whoa. Oh, oh I thought that was actually real. <laughs> oh, what the? That's kind of hot, dude. Oh, wait. That's a bad name. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I thought she was giving birth. Damn. Yeah. Could you imagine? No. Jeez. That was one of the most common punishes. See? The lady is blowing something. So, uh... On one side, you had some nails, so your body would get lots of wounds, and then she's blowing ashes, hot ashes, and possibly salt on you, on your wounds. What the fuck? Yeah. Damn, they get creative out here. Yeah, you know, actually, I think we need some of these in, like, chiropractors. So this one would help stretch you out a bit, though. Yeah, I actually kind of like it. You can it. grow. Yeah. I don't think you can grow if he kills them then. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Should I put it in there? So how would you die on this one? Would it be like your arm would get like ripped out of the sockets and then eventually ripped off? Your bone is right there, your back bone. Yeah, because they put your legs, your um, arms over there, your legs over here. And, and your backbone is what breaks first? Basically, yeah. I figured your arms would like pull your out of the arms, socket. They pull your arms and then, It's yeah. pretty small. Because they, they were a short. a small person. They were short in those times. Yeah. It's like that cave. Oh, Jesus. Wow. wow. That is how you break your arms. Wow. Your shoulders would definitely pop out of there. Yeah, but that wouldn't kill you. Like, yeah. I think you would just die from starvation. Yeah. And maybe just be in pain. Yeah, mind about it. I was hanging there, probably beating him and cutting them and True. like doing all these other Take crazy things. Yeah. Wow. Well, Thank you so much You're for welcome. the tour and the information. You're welcome. We appreciate it. Thanks for also dealing with our stories. Professionalism. Well, yeah. Is there any like last story you'd want us to reenact for you before you go? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, that's that was totally done. enough for me, honestly. That makes, that makes sense. <laughs> you really, if you want to convince me you're coming from Hollywood, you really did. No, oh, thank you. That's a compliment. Wow. Thank you. I don't, know, wait, so I don't know if it's a compliment. That was sweet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, no. You did your effort. You did your good. It's enough. You did your Trust effort. Me. If you enjoyed the visit and if you enjoy the castle itself, if you enjoy Transylvania, so have fun yeah. on the rest of the tour. Thank, thank you. Yeah. Yeah, thank it was you great. so much. Appreciate it. I think we should keep uh, staying attended, though. So, Evan, would you, would you mind? We're going to all. Evan, come on. Evan, come on. Let's go back in. Come on. Come on. got to stay right, attended. Yeah. Stay attended. Yeah, you're right. Evan. Stay attended. Okay. All right, cool. cool. All right, thank you so much. Bye. Thanks. Have a good night. See ya. Enjoy yourselves. Bye. Thank you. Have fun. Okay. Stay attended, everyone. We're attended, dude. We're attended. As long as we keep holding hands, I'm going to investigate. With I feel like the honestly, we're almost starting a seance at this point. It's gonna be scary. <laughs> the dungeon. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we officially have the castle entirely to ourselves. I actually don't know if anyone's ever done a paranormal investigation here. Wow. Ever. Should be maybe the first to do this. I, we might be that I could find because I looked and I'd never seen any TV shows here. I'd never I've seen like YouTube channels come here but never have it to themselves and have all their tools. So it's rumored to be haunted. People have seen things, they've heard things, rightfully so. I mean, we've heard a few stories about the people that have met their fate here, but it's not like they were keeping records. No. So we not. have no idea. They basically had entertainment of killing people here. Right. Even That's like true. right here. I mean, if, if the king met here and someone suggested an idea they didn't know. Mm -hmm. I'm yeah. sure hundreds of people have been killed. Within, especially, like there's been people that have killed you. Been killed you. Yeah, over 500 something years. Oh, yeah. Normally we have yeah, one yeah. REM pod, but now we have a second one. Mm -hmm. And we have a third one. Huh. And we have a whole new set of cat balls. They're all brand new. And then beyond that, we of course have like the motion tracker mm -hmm. device, and we have a brand new thermal device. Oh. Thermal? This is just a fully thermal, brand new device. So instead of the SLS camera, which is kind of like luggy, 
this thing will not lie to you. It will 100% your life. Pick up. Oh, look at that. So, oh, wow. dang, I want to get that. 100% right. <laughs> will pick up any heat at all. So, have you seen it? Oh, wow. Oh, that's so legit. So, incredibly accurate. This is a tool used for like construction to figure out if there's like steam escaping, if any pipes are overheating. Oh, wow, that's scary. So, incredibly reliable device. Ah. We always talk about Ooh. taking pictures. We never do. Would anyone care to take the camera tonight? I like that idea. You got the camera? I'll like do this. it. So we'll take pictures all throughout the night. And we have a brand new K2. Wow. It also tells you the temperature. So we We're getting high tech. Yeah, we've like really upgraded. In the least technological place we've ever been. Oh. And I bought this for a reason. Ah. The yeah. reason being, and obviously this right, supposed to take energy and convert it to words, but reading on forums and other people that use it, they believe that essentially, no matter what language it might be, it can still convert it to English. So apparently that's what this device has the ability to do, so that's why we have it now. We definitely need a translator. And that is everything that we have. Well, should we set up maybe some devices in here and see what happens? Yes. Yeah. I'm gonna get a cat ball too. We have some cat balls. Wow, you can take pictures on this. Oh, and for the record, that all the new devices I've left in our house, like on for like 24 straight hours and none of them ever went off. So, your house really? isn't so my house isn't haunted and also I know that these do not go off. Wow. I left them completely on literally next to my bed overnight. Like and nothing never went off. No. They can move over there. I like that. Yeah, the only way this thing goes heartbeat, oh, that's you have to grab it. I think it has like a sensitivity. Mm-hmm. You know how Patty always opens the veil? With like her, her kind of her, I don't know what you'd call it, not her, her speech, rhetoric, but her message, it's her, like her enchantment. Yeah. yeah. So I found one in Latin oh. that essentially is the same thing, but assuming that everyone that lived here spoke Latin for the most part. And you wrote it down and you're gonna. Mm -hmm. I have it on my phone. Yeah. I screenshotted it. That's very Elton. Let's just hear it. So here we go. Mm -hmm. Stacum narte ut vidurum et motorum amicum on oste manam operat carimeth nisi aditas ad alterum partum felix qui statum communicandi inter luci et tenebris et buf disrupti offero nosotrum industria quasi obrotum levis exolitum Non opus est tibi, ut quis dabit vobis potestatum. Benedictio in ora exitas nostri. Revelamini pessimis. Fiat portum tentire quad rosterus in veberus typina. Et vitam et mortam the light. Told us. Did you hear the bang when you were Yeah, we heard a bang when you were reading. You didn't hear I it. heard that. Yeah. It was above us. Well. Temperature's gone up. No device. We do not mean any harm at all to you. And we're also not able to see you, but we think that you might be able to see and hear us. If that's true, could you please try interacting with us with one of our tools that we've placed on the ground? We have this little tool that is a ball that if you touch it, it'll shine light. I placed one on the stairs and one on this door. Hello. What are you thinking, Josh? I'm thinking like, it's so big that who's ever dead could be anywhere. You know what I mean? Like they could be all chilling in one room somewhere else or they're just here, they're just not knowing what we're saying. Cause if they were all speaking Latin and we're just trying to talk, they don't know what we're saying. All right, so should we split up? Okay. Who goes where? Because this is a huge castle. And everyone mm -hmm. will be, what do they do? So do you want to come with me to 
the jail. Heck yeah. Do you guys want to do the well and the bear fist? Yeah. And then I can go solo? Yeah. Okay. Cool. cool. Oh, damn. Oh, 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 no, but it won again. It's it's one. I got the second one. It just... We're literally talking about where we everyone should, should wait go. A minute. Wait, wait, wait. Are you here? Can you walk over to us? Ridiculous. We, we turn off the camera <laughs> for two for minutes. Just two minutes to talk about like who should go where, and and it goes off. Every R ridiculous. Time, Every man. time. We don't want to scare you. I feel like I'm gonna scare you. It caught the second, the second one. Yeah, I got the one, second right? one. Well, now I'm thinking someone should go that way. Dude, I saw it leave. Oh, man, maybe, 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 that way. maybe the haunted tower. The oh, tower, true. Yeah. That could be true, actually, yeah. Man, it's really freaking dark in there. That was wow. Sick. And it looked nothing. That was nothing sick. since, of that course. Sick, Dude, it's literally like a ghost just went down the stairs. Yeah. I said I genuinely believe that the new REM pods will not go off. Did you put ten thousand dollars of confidence on that one, or uh, what's the new one? Last time what's we said we're holding one, and then the other one's like the smaller coffin one. All right, well let's like, try another. I left them up in my house, twenty-four hours, brand new batteries, with people walking around, never once went off. Remember when we first got this one? Mm -hmm. We used it. A bunch of videos that never did a single thing, and then you were like, I'll bet 10 grand that thing does not go off. And we're in Missouri State Penitentiary. Yep. It went off. It would not. It went off and a motion light. Mm -hmm. Well, that's pretty cool. I don't, I don't think the new ones go off. All right, well, I can leave all these here unless anyone wants to take them with you. Put it's gone up 10 put degrees. Put degrees. It's gone up 10 degrees. And it's nighttime? Yeah, it's just, I think it should be getting colder in here. All right, guys, so what we're going to do is we're going to use the REM pod. We got uh, the music box, another REM pod, and we got cat balls. We're going to start off here at the well. And maybe if the prisoners did die, they'll want to talk to us. Exactly. Let's try here first. Three poor dudes that just spent 15 years of their lives digging this hole only to be killed. Yeah, that's, that's ridiculous. Oh. I am cap calibrating. Dude, I wish I could drop a cat ball down there. Oh. I'll solo in a haunted castle in Romania. Looking for any ghosts that might be here. Well, in theory. Yeah, it totally did. Immediate. Yeah, it by 100%. The temperature is going down too. I shook it and set it down and it stopped and then it immediately went off. Hello? Temperature is going down. Is it true that you guys spent 15 years building this well just to die in the end? You can talk to us through this device that I'm pointing at. You just have to touch it. Or maybe you can sit down on the left of me where my hand is. This is where the priest was. If there's 
anyone that's trapped in here, if you can't leave, if you could please just touch one of the tools that we've set up around, make it go off. All you have to do is put your energy into it and that'll let us know that you are communicating with us. We don't mean no harm. We're gonna leave after tonight and we most likely will never be able to talk to you again. And you we just wanna know if there's... Did you hear something? Like talking or what? No, like a little... Like a, uh, a high pitch noise. Did you hear that? Uh, I heard you that. heard that, right? Yeah. I didn't hear that. Yeah, that was over here. Come in here! If you're watching us. You hear it again? I heard a beep and then a like it We would like to talk to you. It's coming from the torture chamber. Place and demand. Place and demand. Yeah, place. Where? They were demanded to dig this. Oh, they were. Okay. Where do you want us to go? If you're a prisoner, we might be able to help you and get you out of here. But you need to talk to us. And let us know where you want us to go. Maybe we can give you some food. Can we go down there? It's blocked off, it looks like. Is that? I can't see. Maybe it's oh, there's a chain right there. Besides the chain? That is the beer can. We can probably go down there. Yeah. And maybe let's go everywhere else. Should we just do it? Should we go into the field where they, where they yeah, like like now buy beers? Really cool. Yeah, actually, let's do that. Yeah. Let's take this right, so Do you want hey. us to go into the torture chamber? Look at this real quick. Jonah, look at this. <gasps> you see Whoa. that? Did you that see that? That had to be you. No, that had to be Jonah. No way. That had to be Jonah. It was not. No, that had to be your shadow. It wasn't. No, that had to be Jonah's shadow. No, it wasn't. Jonah, walk back that way. Oh, look, 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 look. Wait, no, Jonah, keep walking back that way. There. It's we not. Did, we did not just It's see not. That. Get over here, Jonah. What? No, a person look, just look, walked look. past it. Look, 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 look. No, you saw the person look, look, look. walking. It's right here. It's in the middle. No, but did you see? Are you the peeking person out? Walking? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. No, Jonah. I thought it was like your shadow. No, there's no light. Like on this side, the light's coming from right here. It wouldn't. My shadow would be Please on the other side of the room. Please tell me this thing's recording, or if it records. I don't think it does. It takes pictures. Now I don't know if that was just coincidence. That after I set the cat ball down, it went off. So if you're upset that I'm in here, you'd like to make your presence known, could you please do it again? Oh, 
Dude, I would totally just hide in there and hope that the bear wasn't like too big to get you. Yeah. I'm gonna put this rim pod on the stairs. Well, at least near the exit here. Like it was a full person. It was a person. It was a head and it was shoulders and it was going to the left. Are you still here? Dude, that had that that had to have been Jonah's shadow. It couldn't have been. No, there's no way. It couldn't have been. The light source is coming from no, this side. I swear. My shadow view over here. I've never seen that. I've never seen that either. And it, it went all the way from over here around. We look, 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 look. Dog, we just saw a person walk past that. And this is probably some line full of people watching. Yeah, like watching just die. Get ripped to shreds out here by bears. So we have this device here that you can touch. If you're here and you want to speak, touch any of these devices. Bed. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna pick up the device and go to a different part. Wow. Okay, wait, you ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna yeah. walk past it. Okay, you ready? Go. Nothing. You're joking. Not a thing. Not Dude, thing. Jonah, it was a full f***ing body. Head, shoulders, body, and it just walked. It was right as you walked towards us. As you walked towards us, it What? The that was nuts. So that doesn't record video. No, it doesn't. <laughs> Funeral. Funeral. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. If you want me to save you from the bear, stand in front of me. It said bear. Was oh, it bear? Yeah, when I said bear, it said bear. And it said head. Oh. The way it comes from right here and then you turn to here and everything becomes red, right? Why is that? That makes no sense, right? And then we came like this, and all of a sudden there was like a, a figure. We are like, that must be something with this. It was not him at all. I don't know if I can actually put together what just happened or not. What the hell? Wait, that wasn't you? No, I think, I think it fell off the castle, though. I think a rock fell off the side? I think so. But that was kind of weird, actually. Yeah. I literally heard something big fall. It says living. Voice and living, it just said no. Are you living here? Are you stuck here? Who threw that? Dude, what did we just say? Like they probably threw rocks at people. Oh, yo, know, actually, yeah, dude. I, at first, I was just like, oh, something fell, or one of you guys did it. Unless you guys didn't, I don't know. No, I was looking in that little hole over there. I'm holding the camera. Wow, dude. dude we might actually cause something. I literally was just like saying they probably threw rocks at people if they tried to climb out of here. Can you give us a sign that you're here, or stand in front of me? I really, just want that to go off. For the record, I have no light. This is infrared, so this is what? 
I'm saying it's pure darkness. Let's go to the side to remove yeah. what you were saying? Yeah, I think we should. That could have been something, maybe. I don't know. That was weird. That was pretty cool. Oh, man. We'll get this off. We're getting this to go off in the cast. I don't care. It's happening. It has to. It has to. Hello, friends of the castle. I know this might seem weird because you might have been wrestling for the last hundreds and hundreds of years. But myself and the friends that I have here at the castle with me, we're in a search to find out if there is an existence after death. We've been to many places during our time of the search, but we've never been somewhere as old as this. If we just saw you walk past us on one of our devices, could you please touch the device that's up there on that piece of wood? If you try to grab it, it'll make a noise. We're not here to hurt you. We just want to talk to you. We wish we could help you. Were you tortured in here? You can come out. You don't have to be scared of us. We're not going to hurt you. I figured if we're gonna die anywhere in the castle besides the like uh, dungeon area, mm -hmm. it'd be in that attacking tower. Oh, with like little gun things? Yeah. yeah. I really wanna do something in there. I know Elton might be in there, but I feel like maybe he dipped already. We should go at least go Yeah, you, know, you don't know where he could be at this point. But he yeah, could just be Roman. Yeah, I wanna let's do that to really that. bad. Yeah, I like that spot. That would be sick. Yeah. Put in the little like gun windows. Yeah. Scared it. It's not coming out anymore. Dude, I don't know how we just saw that on the infrared. Seriously? Your light? Yeah. Why are you hitting it? That's how you fix a right? Oh, you're right, you're right. Let me see. Go oh, tight. Thank you. I appreciate it. I didn't drop it. it. I didn't drop it. So you broke Evan's light? I didn't break it. But so it's dead. <laughs> Just died. Yeah. Did so you charge it, Evan? I mean, it's fresh doubly batteries. And now it just don't work? No. Either the ghost drained it or you broke it. I definitely didn't break it. <laughs> what the f*** did Nothing. we see, Corbin? Nothing. Right? Dude, what did we see? Let's go to the torture chamber. Let's go. I feel like you can follow us. Follow oh us to the torture chamber. God. We actually saw that. Oh, yes. Damn. oh, it's working now. Hey. Huh. Hmm. It's very weird. What's this now? Do you hear that? Yeah. Sound like it was right over here. Did you rip ass? No. I didn't rip ass, did you? No. It smells clean in here. God, I want that rim pod to go off. Me too. Know, so dude. bad.
intimidated by us? What is that? You see that moving? Tell me the f not. What the f Dude, that has to be someone because I'm gonna trip the f out. Haven't you seen that down there? The yeah. black. Dude, that has to be someone. Can you see that on camera? Dude, I'm telling you right now, if, if, if someone's pranking us, okay, but if no one's not, that'll be the first time I've ever seen a black figure shadow. Oh, uh, same, dude, same. I'm gonna hit my head on this. He's giving me a teeny bit of light. What is this? I don't even know if I'm supposed to be down here. Look how long the door is. Man, they were short. Or maybe that was part of the torture. Unless it's my eyes next to the No, dude, because I saw the movement. I had to like really focus my eyes to see it, but yeah. Oh, that's on. Now I gotta scare it for a minute. And where was that other REM pod so I don't step on it? Oh, we might be able to debunk it. Maybe. It was this floating, like the tar. Was it? Maybe, it's the only thing I can think of. I feel like we would have heard that though. Yeah, I, I don't so, think we- It's hard to say. Yeah. With the wind moving, it did look like it was like a floating dress. Yeah. It, it has to be this, cause if not, bro, <laughs> it, it was- Yeah, that was wild. That was, that got me, that it, got me. I, 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 I thought it was Elton, like coming up a step. I, yeah, and yeah. And like slowly walking out of frame. Hold. Hold me. Oh. And I have to leave to outside or further down. I'm gonna have to. Okay, I'm sweating and I'm freezing at the same time. That just looks so creepy. I know. It's just so pitch black in there. I just have to go back in and get our stuff anyway. Yeah. We should do five more minutes in here. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Never know. Who's in this tower with us? Seems like you want to go in the dungeon. We have the uh, box on the floor, devices all around. Help us help you. Says Ravine. What are you doing? I think oh. that on one of these flashes I see something down there. Oh, yeah. 
Oh, that's so. Oh my God. Could you imagine? Some people say if you take pictures with your phone, like a flash, it could like make something appear. Uh, that's why we have my that camera. Oh yeah, I never, I never tried that method. In only yeah. like two weeks ago, I've seen someone used it and it worked for them. So it made me like interested in it. Don't even know where I am. Or part of me thinks that these are crypts of some nature. At least they were. Or if anything, it was another place. Torture. Okay. Unfortunately, do not know where I am right now. But everything in my body is telling me that something terrible come on, the camera on. happened down here. And I'm hoping that perhaps I'm right because I have never been so cold and so sweaty at the same time. This is potentially the worst I have ever felt. for me shortly after I set them down which makes me feel like the reason why I'm getting colder and sweatier is because it's not in these different rooms actually next to me. Did the queen send you here? Were you stuck down here because of the queen? Temperature keeps rising. What the f was that? Did you hear that? Was that I thought that was you. No. The deep was, bassy sound. It was like a. Uh, yeah. Was that you? Are you communicating with us through Knox? It's gonna get lucky. There could be a lot of activity happening with Elton or. It's Corey true. Corbin, you know? They could be possessed by now. Probably. I know. <laughs> you have no idea. What they, time is it? Should we meet up with them? Or should we? What time? I don't even know. Uh, one twenty. So it's not like forty minutes. Maybe we should go see what they call. It. I don't know. If not, yeah. we can keep roaming and keep trying. What do you think, Evan? You think we should meet up? With them? I, I'd say let's meet up with them. Time to figure out what's behind. Are you innocent? Do 
I just saw a, uh, like a, uh, like a, hand, like, no, like a mist of light just fly above you. Really? Yeah, my eyes are really playing with me here. I'm not even playing. Like, it was like a mist of light was coming out of this, and it was like above you, just like shining down. I'm not even playing. Are you above me? You can touch me. It's there again. I just saw it again. Dude, I just saw it again. It's like a white, white mist. No, dude, it's like in the morning when light is shining in through a window. Yeah. There's no window in here. At all. There's not a window back on that side or No, anything. no, nothing. And even if it was, it's not daylight. You mean to the outside? Yeah. No, it's just stone. Where am I? Is there any... Ooh, damn. Dives. Dives? Dives, bail, British. Dives. Set up one more gap ball. Nowhere to go. Nowhere I can possibly be right now. It's up here. That's where you felt it was. You hear that? Yeah, I heard that. Is it pointed at me? No, it's not. No? Where's it pointed at? Uh, it's pointed at the door. Oh, shit. All right. That was, our, that was something. Yeah. That, that, was was a, that, was little, that was a quick little walk. Someone could be here. There's a device right here on the stairs. That will give a bit of light. Like that. Now I know typically light like this would be scary for you. Cause it seems as if it's a tiny bolt of lightning. I think I'm right. I think someone's been following me. Everywhere I've gone, starting the priest chapel. You're right, I'm right. You're here with me, okay? Okay, that... I, this... Okay, you're intelligent, okay. So. I'm gonna ask you a question, you can light it up. If you're here to do me harm, or you do not like me, can you please light it up right now? If you are here following me because you're intrigued 
and interested to see someone here at night for the first time, you please light it up. Et post ostium stent consilia placetire. Please stand next to the door and make one of our devices go off. Yes, say thank you. If you're following me, or if this has just been the strangest string of coincidence I've ever had. I just realized I'm the one that read the opening of the veil in Latin. For all I know, I pronounced something horribly wrong. And that is the reason this is happening. Never read Latin in my life. And it's very possible. I really screwed up. Okay, I'm back in the room where I first read the enchantment, the inscription, the opening. I was standing right here. While we were here, none of the devices went off. Except for one over there. So, you are following me, or if I created you, I'm gonna set this down right here. Give you the chance to prove that I am an idiot. You already know what to do. Tell us your story. Swear man, I feel like I can see something in the fireplace. Stop, because I've been thinking that I can see something in the fireplace. Can you see it too? Yes. If you move a device right there in the fireplace, we'll know you're there. 
I can't wrap my head around this one. Normally I can figure out some plausible reason. It's not going off. And to me, that means all the others were real, genuine. I thought maybe because I was setting it off and then setting it down, it was rolling. No. Dude, I've never seen a light up like that. They were holding it. Like they were like, ooh, new jewelry and holding it. I, and yeah, you said that. I did. Right there. Yeah. That's so dude, cool. Dude, the fact that we sat here, we sat, cut three other places, talked forever and got yeah. nothing. Yeah, and we did use it and, and got we, nothing. And we translated one time and immediately. Yeah. That was crazy. And we asked to do it again and then it did it again. Did you grab and the Google Translate, yeah. Right. So good. That was sick. Well, our work here's done. <laughs> Welcome you to come stand with me. And I would love to meet you. Goodbye forever. Do not follow us. You have five seconds. If you want to touch anything else, five, four, three, two, one. You do not have permission to follow us. Do not follow me back home. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, boys, what's boys, up? Boys. What up, losers? Uh -huh. I'm just saying there's no way you guys got better yeah. at this than us. Uh, I don't know. Hey, I don't, I don't know. know about that. Dude. We physically saw something. Well, yeah. yeah. We thought we did too. We did too. We went no, and investigated. Like, wait, 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 wait. I think I cursed myself. Fought just now? Do? I think I fed up something when I read the Latin thing, and I think now there's a thing behind me. So it only took you this long? The, okay, so the only thing I had was the cap off. Oh, you had that go off? That's still cool though. That's pretty good, yeah. That's all right. I mean, it's all right compared wait, 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 to what we got. What know. do you mean you cursed? That doesn't yourself. mean you got yeah, cursed. Oh yeah, what's the curse? Has anyone ever, ever, have we ever had this happen where the cat ball would respond to questions? I guess oh. we never really have had that. The REM pod, right? But a cat ball, five questions in a row. What? No. No, I need to see that. Okay, no. I, yeah, I want to see, see that. that. What? Are you serious? Yeah. I'm dead serious, and I found like a secret tunnel passage system. Because underneath. of those questions? No. Yeah, what'd you guys, hey, what'd you guys get? get? So on the... What do you guys want? It's like we're like trading so, lunch on the school. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Who's got gushers? So we went to the jail cell first. Yeah. Okay. And when we went to the jail cell, you know, we put all our stuff down and everything like that. And then we had our thermal out, and we're like, okay, I'm checking everything around and it's hot somewhere, it's different somewhere. So I look over here and literally I see a head and a body. And I'm thinking to myself, like, is that, is that Jonah? Right? Just walking so, across. Yeah, yeah, literally, just walking across. On the thermal thing? On the thermal. On the thermal. Yeah, so I'm like, is that okay. recorded? Yeah, yeah. It doesn't record video, you it have to snap you have to take a picture. picture. And I was, I was just like this because I thought it was Jonah, right? Because huh. Jonah was walking to us. And then we were like, oh, shit. That doesn't have any heat. There's no heat. It was all blue. Because Jonah is almost behind us. Yeah. And we have the camera in front of us. So the wall is blue. And then this blue outline of a person Starts is just walking, walking on the, th like it took probably four seconds to go across the screen. It was colder. It was a person. Mm -hmm. I want to see that. I want to see something of that. That sounds really cool. And then uh, we went up into another room yep. and we were doing Google Translate Latin. And uh, we got the, cap ball to go off. Oh, were bit. you typing in English and then reading it yeah. in Latin? Yeah. But what was the question? Uh, the qu So we were in the uh, the room where the guy was talking bad about the priest, right? Yep. And the fireplace. Uh, the yeah. Fireplace. Yeah. Yep. And okay. so we said, you know, did you do something bad? Like, are you guilty? And immediately it goes off. Yeah. In the fireplace. That's where the it ball, started for me. Ball was in the fireplace. The first place the cat ball went off for me was up there. And then that's what started leading me around the entire castle. What? Wow. Wait, it was in the fireplace where it mm -hmm. went off? No, wow. it was in the fireplace in the center of the room for me. Oh, oh it was okay. in the fireplace. For us, it was a legit fireplace. Damn. Okay. You guys dude. seem like you're holding well, on to some information. It was pretty good, I mean, dude. That's well, nice. nice. We, we started, started at the at well, didn't get anything. We went inside the bear pit. Like we had a rock thrown at us. It. Yeah. Wait, how? Rock. I don't know. We, we think found so. a secret staircase and we went down into the bear pit. I could probably, if like I was down there with a bear, I would be trying to climb the wall because it's like big enough rocks that you could probably climb yeah. it. Mm -hmm. And then we were like, oh, but wait, like if you were, there was probably just so many people up there watching. They'd probably oh, yeah. just throw rocks at you to like Definitely. get you to fall down. 
20 seconds later, a rock literally falls or comes from somewhere yep. and, and we hear it hit the ground. And the ovulus says bear uh -huh. right after. Get, Get the, the out. We have it. Get we have the it. out. It was nuts. It. The what? ovulus There's 150,000 words minimum yep. programmed into that. It says bear. Yep. Yeah. And we've never heard bear before on that. And that's not Get even that. that. Hey, no, that's, that's not even cool, the crazy. but we got more. Okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, what else? What else? What else? So, so we, we go up into that hallway, yeah. right? We go. In, wait. Oh yeah. Then we go into the hallway and we see all, and it's on camera, but we see a whole kind of shadow figure like move. I thought it was you. And we thought you guys were pranking thought us. Thought it was you messing with us. No, because I stayed away from everyone at all costs. Yeah. I could hear you. Now for that one, we could debunk and say maybe it was this tarp that was moving in the wind. Okay. But it's 50-50. So we'll yeah. say on 50-50. But then the yeah. next place, we go into the bedroom. And we're sitting down in this bedroom that you guys never actually seen yet. Yeah. And we ask like um, the this to, to make the REM pod box go off, and it did. It, but we Google translated like you guys did, and we we made it speak out loud on the app. So yeah. What did you, make, what what you, we did. Did you say to it? But what well, we asked a couple things, like we were asking a bunch of stuff in there. Yeah. Nothing's happening. But the music box did go off in front of the door yeah. once. So like, okay, maybe we got something. Yeah. So then Evan started first and asked a question, like to make something go off. And then the, the, the music box, uh, not the music box, the REM pod box went off. Like hard, like uh, which one? immediately. Which one? The, the, chest. Like the wooden one. The one we had for yeah. a while. Yeah. Okay. But, yeah. but it was when we asked the question, it never went up the entire time for us. Yeah. And then we said, after 10 minutes, we did another Google Translate, say, hey, can you make it go off again? We'll give you food. We hit it, immediately. Goes off. And it's all recorded. Like anything we said in English, nothing ever yep. happened. And wow. then this very what? first time we Google translated anything, it was like wow. within one or two seconds of after the translation came out loud, <laughs> yep. the REM pod goes off immediately. Yep. I remember when we were in the hotel room getting ready for this video, and I was like, hold on, there's no way we were speaking Romanian. I was like, what language is it? And I was like, I think it's Latin. And he was like, no. And then it was Latin. And then I was like, I bet you if we use Latin, it would work. Yep. Yeah, I don't know why we've never wow. done that. Like when we were no. in Costa Rica, we should have been using the Google Translate thing. Like, yeah, definitely. but we also have the Coast Guard evacuate us from Costa Rica. So yeah. we didn't really have much time there. That's true, sure. that's true. Yeah, but, that's true. wow. Because, okay, so what was happening for me was, and again, like we've used cat balls hundreds of times and yeah. I've never seen this happen. So to me, it's like, it's, cool. it's not coincidence. I would sit down the cat ball and I would wait for it to stop going off and it would stop moving. And then I would step away and then, I don't know, maybe like 10, 15, 20 seconds later, it would go off. And I would take pictures as it's going off, which I haven't looked at any of the pictures yet. Mm. Okay. So I would take pictures as it's going off and oh, see if I could double it. Good. Could you that's imagine good. if there's right? a hand or something? But then, so it wouldn't go off again. And then I would go to a different room and I would set it down and it would go off and I'd wait 15, 30 seconds and then it would go off. And then I would go to a different room and again, it would only go off like after I set off. And then finally, I ended up in this random basement cellar I don't really know what it is, but there's a lot of artifacts and stones and it looked like a crypt that was down there. And then finally my brain goes, wait, what if there's not activity in each room? What if the reason why it's going off is because I set it down, uh, I step away, and then it follows me. And then uh, finally I, was, I, I stepped way, way, way further away from it and I asked that question. I was like, is there something following me and it goes off? I want to see that. And it goes off and then I wait again and I go, are you following me like because I'm an intruder? Like do you think I'm like I'm a Turk like what the tour guide said? Like do you think I'm a spy? Nothing. And I go, is it possible that I read the Latin enchantment wrong and I summoned this and it goes off. Damn. And it like it goes like, I mean, question over, boom. Okay, the real question. Yes. Did you give it permission to follow you? No, but I don't know what I said in Latin. If I said, <laughs> what do you mean you don't know what you said? Well, in Latin? I'm saying if I oh, no. pronounce one thing wrong, could have said a whole other different word. Yeah, you know what I mean. Like think about how easy it is to confuddle the English language. Oh, I'm sure you messed up most of those. Right. Heard yeah. the word so maybe everything I said, I said it's so wrong. Wow. Oh my God. Interesting night. Cool. Oh, yeah. yeah. Cool. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Fun. Great. It was a I'm, solid. We didn't night. have enough time here. We need. No. We this need to cancel all night. their tours in the morning yep. so we can just stay another night here. Yeah. I know. Dead it ass. was fun. I'm so glad you're singing in another room. For Do me. these. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad. Let's... On that note, <sighs> let's go to bed. Yeah, we need to get sleep for tomorrow. All right, can we all just take a moment to appreciate that, like, this. We, like, this is what we're doing for our <laughs> job. Like this is how we're spending our, is it, is it Monday night? 
Uh, Tuesday summer Saturday. night. Don't even is it know. Saturday? It's Sunday. It's sa- no, now it's Sunday. No, it's Sunday. I have no idea. It used to be Saturday. Oh, okay. Yeah, at one time. Like, this couldn't be any cooler. Like, a full moon is just... What just drives me crazy every place we go is like all the people, you know, that were tortured, murdered here, the knights, the horses, the bear, yeah. you know, cage, whatever area that is. It's like the only difference is like time. Yeah. We're just we're just in a different time right now, so that's not going on. But at one point in time, that that's what on. that's what was happening here. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I was just trying to enjoy how beautiful it is. But, you know, <laughs> we can talk about, about that too. Right? Bro, bro, could you imagine just seeing like 40 knights all just geared up right there, carrying someone to throw into a bear pit? <laughs> like, no, like now it's like we come here, we ghost hunt, and then we get McDonald's. Yeah. Back then it was like, hey, were you looking at my girls? Like, no. Oh, you're a liar. Bear pit. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Bro, I just right. wanted to enjoy the full moon in a castle. <laughs> like, that's, that's all I wanted to do right now. And you're like, Are you imagine having your limbs chopped off and fed to a wild bear. Well, that's what I'm saying. We're sitting here like, wow, it's so beautiful. But then imagine the people yeah. that got tortured yeah. here. Or imagine the people are like, well, at least I'm going to get tortured somewhere beautiful. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, <laughs> right wow. in between us. That's happened in people's heads. So Probably that's definitely what they're thinking about. Like, beautiful. Like, oh, my life's getting ripped apart, Whoa. but at least it's beautiful. <laughs> it's the worst place to die. <laughs> All right.